In this video, I am going to show you Annex Show 1 Unpaid Unpaid Journals and also we will check whether it is indexed in Scopus and SCI. I am going to show you the important information in the first five journals whether it is paid or unpaid everything we are going to check so the first journal is what 2d materials so let us see this 2d materials so what you have to check is what uh, what is the frequency and how long they are taking to send you the uh, result okay so four day median submission to first decision before peer review is four day 33 days of uh, median submission okay and the impact factor is very good so we can definitely think about it so let us go and check what is the scope of the journal so that is very very important let us see the scope you can go and check the about the journal to find the scope of the journal so whether if this suits your uh, expectation like they are uh, talking about boron nitride transition metal discharge complex oxides composite uh, materials everything okay if this is fine with you if this is your scope of your uh, um, thing then you can definitely go and check for the author guidelines so what are the guidelines you have so how to publish and everything they have given okay so uh, we have checked that whether it is in annex annex one yes it is in annex one and you can you have we, can, we have also checked like what is the frequency and the scope then what we have to check we have to check for the publication charges so let's go and check for the publication charges yes of course you have to pay okay this is article publishing charge and they they are given like this is what the publication charges if you are okay with that in few uh, universities you will be uh, allocated with a specific amount if you are okay with that then proceed or else let us go and check the next annex okay next journal from the annex one so the second one is what three biotech so let us see this is three biotech so once if you click this you will be getting this journal home page okay you can see like how many uh, days they are taking they are taking 16 days great so within 16 days you will be getting the first decision excellent so let's go to the submission guidelines and see like what are the scope of the journal so let us see the, sc see the scope of the journal and everything here you can find the complete information about the scope and uh, uh, what is the um, uh, how you have to format and everything okay so in, since it is showing like a three biotech you can find that this they are talking about the biotechnology related information so here if you click here show all you can find the uh, information about it okay so this is what scoper uh, scope is indexed okay so let us see what is the um this is what the pdf which i got it from here so here you can download the author information from the submission guidelines okay once you downloaded that information what you will be getting you have to check for fee okay pay charges so you have to check for one thing like others can pay fee currently three thousand uh, dollars that is for open access publication you have to uh, note down this you don't want to pay any one rupee or one dollar that is if you are not going for open access publication and if you're opting for open access publication then you have to definitely pay a fee and if you are uh, if your college or university or institution is uh, having agreement with the spring that is a springer then you don't need to even pay the open access charge okay other than that uh, if you are only opting for open access you have to pay or else it no need to pay fine so uh, what we have checked is the very second one which is uh, open access so three three biotech is what the free publications okay the third one is what 3d printing and additive manufacturing here we go so here you can see that uh, it is its impact factor and it is published bi-monthly okay and then if you scroll down you can see the journal information everything here they have mentioned that submission fee is none so great uh, so the third journal also it doesn't cost any charge 3d printing and additive manufacturing okay so here you can see that no submission fee and the next one is what you can see the manuscript types and everything and average time to initial decision is 28 days great so these information you can find it from for authors okay for authors drink you can find everything okay what are all the guidelines and how you have to submit what are the confidentiality and everything you have to you have to check and submit it and what is the next journal which is 4OR a quarterly journal of operations research so this is what 4OR of course in Springer you know they will not charge for most of the journals okay they'll only uh, charge for 
article publication charges that is if you want to make it one if you want to make it as an open access journal then definitely they will ask for article public publication okay article processing charges so uh, you can directly go ahead anyhow you have to check twice okay go ahead and check your uh, uh, submission to the author guidelines uh, they will be mentioning like what uh, what charges they are offering so it will be downloaded as a pdf file great so even here there is no uh, fees for uh, uh, publication that's only fees is apc that is article processing charges will be there okay so the fifth one is aapg bulletin right so this is what aapg bulletin you can see here this is aapg bulletin and it is 3.158 and uh, how many days they are taking and this is six i think it is eight articles in this issues okay for one uh, for one issues they are going uh, they are uh, printing eight articles okay and uh, you can find more information here so about the journal so what are the uh, what uh, how many days they are taking what is the subscription and everything in few journals you know you can't find the exact information directly like what is the publication charge what is the uh, what is the uh, if, if there are any hidden charges and everything if you couldn't find it no worries just leave a message to them okay so here you can find the submission submitting uh, to a publication you can simply find only few informations then no worries you can just go here and see uh, contact us page okay so here you can see that for questions regarding page charges please email i think you have page charges here so of course this is a page journal anyhow if you are planning if your uh, article comes into this scope then you can definitely send a mail to this particular person so you can right click and get the copy email address okay it will be copied and then you can paste it in your mail so to or uh, to the two in the two uh, field you can just paste it and send it to them so to request the article processing charges okay what is the page charges or any other hidden charges are available if you want to know how to mail to a specific uh, author the sorry uh, specific uh, editor or um, uh, that is a reviewer reviewer we cannot uh, uh, send a mail if you want to send a mail to the editor just please leave your comments uh, i'll be helping you okay so yes we have seen the first five journals so in this 2d material is paid one and aapg is paid one and other three are, are not paid one okay you can directly go ahead if it definitely works for you then proceed let us search whether it is there in scopus and web of science okay so let us simply search and see it's in subject area you have to just go to the title and make it like a title 2d materials let us see whether it is there in scopus okay yes it is in the scopus you can also find it there in the scope if you want to recheck okay anything any whatever it may be you have to recheck that is fine okay 2d materials yes it is also there in sci okay so you can directly go ahead so let us also check the next one what is the next one free biotech right so let us check whether it is there in the scopus and also in sci okay also always cross checking is fine not only here wherever where, wherever you just yes i think free biotech is also there in the scopus okay you can find free biotech here and also let us check here in sci okay yes it is there in sci great so three biotech is a free free one right so it is uh, fine so let's check for the next one uh, that is uh, 3d printing right so let us check for 3d printing here 3D printing and additive manufacturing. Yes, it is there in Scopus. Let us see whether it is there. Uh, that is uh, present. Okay, let us see. Yes, 3D printing is also there in SCA. I hope that will also be there in the Scopus. Just click here and see whether it is showing present. Okay, that is present means till now it is there in that is in it is indexed in Scopus. So that definitely we have to cross check that is important and it is also there in 3d printing and we have to check for the scopus yes it is there okay let us find the next two um for our quarter publication let us try this as well so yes so i'm just pasting it so of course in any any journal if you're just okay so it is not there it's not there in scopus but it's there in uh, um okay it's there in annexure one so let's proceed with that even in annexure one they'll be updating so yes 
फोर ओ आर इज देयर इन एस सी आई ओके इट इज अंस साइटेशन इंडेक्स एक्सपैंड एस सी आई ई इट इज देयर इन एस सी आई ई बट इट्स नॉट देयर इन द स्कोपस नो प्रॉब्लम इट्स देयर इन एस सी आई राइट सो नो वरीज सो लेट एस फाइंड द लास्ट वन दैट इज ए ए पी जी बुलेटिन लेट इस ऑल्सो फाइंड दिस विल ऑल्सो फाइंड वेदर इट इज इन दैब ऑफ साइंस Yes, A A P G bulletin is there. Great, it is in A uh, Web of Science. Let us find it in the Scopus. Okay, so it is there. Great, it is there. So among these five journals, oh sorry, so A A P G bulletin is there since twenty twenty one only. It's not present. It's not there in the present uh, list of index, but it's there in S C I. Okay, so great. So we have reviewed the first five um, journals, whether it is there in Scopus or not. Sorry, then in Scopus, S C I, and what is the frequency of publication? What is everything? And from now onwards, from the next uh, in the next video, I'll be talking about the next five. uh journals like what is it and uh, how it proceeds okay whether how to how we have to select and everything so if you have any queries you can leave it in the comment box okay i'll definitely helping you out if you require any help in the research please let me know i'll be helping you hope this finds this video finds great if uh, we'll be discussing about the complete list of annexure 1 in the upcoming journals thank you take care bye bye